Hello everyone, Abuhay. This is Loria Salesforce and tonight I'm going to demonstrate to you how I use a flow to create an auto-response email after a lead was created using the web to lead form. As you probably know, I use the web to lead functionality of Salesforce in my guest group in my portfolio. So let us put that to test. Um, because this is so this is a new um form that i created and as you, as you can see um on the email now it says your email please to get an auto response i actually made first name last name and email as required fields so if we will put those um uh, let's see let's say there's none it should be required okay so I'll put that in and I used my Lori Salesforce Gmail as the email for let's okay. So there should be a new email here that will appear and this is the that email. So this is the email that you will get as an auto response once you fill out my guest book and as you can see there's that GIF, and there's a link to my Salesforce portfolio. I'm pretty much inviting the visitor to message me or maybe create a post about that visit. And also, you know, I will request connection or vice versa if we're not connected yet. So anyway, um, this is an older one. Let me delete that. So if I will read i tried if you can if you will see this uh, i tried to debug something without a new entry so in any case um, i tried to also include in my flow uh, my owner id email owner email but um, it wasn't allowing me because apparently i've reached the limit however um i had an older flow which was separate that had you know notifies me of whoever visited me and signed my guest book i tried to deactivate this older one so so as to try if that would allow me to put a second email in my flow for this so that i can also get a copy of this but uh, it also wasn't working so i just reverted it back to just having the email address of the lead and then putting me as the sender and um, I kept my uh, previous notification, email notification about this visitor. If you can also see here, um, I, I also created a task so it will tell me to thank my visitor on LinkedIn. So that's a task that I made and this is how I created that message so if you will go to the lead I will refresh that and Abby Possum should up appear as my new lead and Okay, there she is, and that's my Lori Salesforce email. If I would click on Abby Possum's record, there's my task. Okay, so there it is. Um, two actions in one flow. Email the new contact, which replaces auto-response email and a reminder for me so this is a task to thank the visitor on LinkedIn. okay i hope you enjoyed that 